What's poppin' y'all? It's your girl Taryn Casey, of course. Try to make sure. I was on my way home. I had just come. I just got home from Azteca with my mom and my, my best friend, and I stopped at Walgreens and got me some cheap wine. I had a pina colada earlier, and I was gonna get another drink, but they were like, "No, let's go home. I got things to do. I got things to do." And I was like, "You know what? I'm gonna stop and get me some wine. I'm gonna get me some wine." And I figured, you know what? I'm gonna do an, a video dedicated to cheap wine. If you anything like me. Cheap wine is the way to go. But before I get into the video, you guys, please do me a solid and click that subscribe button down below, as well as the notification button so you know whenever I drop an upload. But without further ado, let's get right into the video. This is my Barefoot review. Barefoot Pink Moscato is a juicy and refreshing wine with bright nectarine aromas and flavors. Layers of raspberry and pomegranate complement the lingering sweet citrus finish. Enjoy with pot stickers, fruit kebabs, Strawberry shortcake, superb. Barefootwine.com for those who need more information about barefoot. Get barefoot and have a great time. I am having a great time, barefoot. Thank you. I really appreciate that. This is really sweet. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna finish all this tonight. I'm fancy. It's, it comes from California. How much more fancier can you get? Cali, what's up? Deliciously sweet. I'm not gonna flex with you guys. This is real, real facts. It does have everything they describe. It's pretty much, it does have a citru citrusy finish. And I can taste like nectarine-ish raspberry flavor. Mm. The color though is really nice too. It, it fits the 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 name. I'm, I'm, let's see, how, does it have any, cal how many calories is in this? It comes from Modesto, California for those who don't know. The 98354. Good thing I'm not pregnant because this is you should not drink this when you're pregnant, okay? Whew. I had a man, I might've been pregnant after tonight, babe. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know what it is about cheap wine though. Is it the convenience? Is it the fact that when you walk into a Walgreens, a Rite Aid, a, 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 a CVS, or whatever your little mini like pharmacy, or what are they called? What are they called? Drugstore, there we go. Drugstore that is just there and you look at that price point and you're just like, yes, to this price point that makes cheap wine so appealing. Right now, y'all, I'm sipping on that barefoot as y'all have seen, that pink Moscato barefoot. And I'm just thinking about the memories that come about when you are drinking cheap wine with your friends, you know what I'm saying? Or even when you're drinking cheap wine by yourself, you know, whether it be you just broke up with somebody or they just broke up with you or you just got some bad news or you just want to relax, you know, it just makes you, I don't know what it is about cheap wine that makes you feel somewhat fancy. Like, is it just me? Is it me? I'm, I know it can't just be me. That feels like something about cheap wine makes you feel kind of classy, makes you feel kind of fancy. It's like, oh, I'm drinking wine and I'm relaxing drinking wine. You know what I'm saying? What are some stories that you guys have, memories that you have, whether it be good or bad, while drinking cheap wine? Because I'm curious. My latest memory was when me and my two of my best friends got together and we just watched some random movies and I sat in a massage chair and we just had this big, huge bottle of wine and we just sipped on it, sipped on it, and I fell asleep. That's my memory. I just wanted to come and talk to you guys about the barefoot wine and just cheap wine memories and just give my review. It's very refreshing. I'm enjoying my life. It's, 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 it, is, it is encouraging living my best life. I just want everyone to know that this is where I'm at right now. Please make sure you guys are following me on Instagram at Taryn Casey, as you see it somewhere on the screen because I'm trying to tag myself. I'm trying to plug myself a little more than I usually do. I've been trying it at Twitter. I'm really bad at it. I'm gonna focus on YouTube and I'm gonna focus on Instagram. That's all I can do right about now. So, um, yeah, that's basically what it is. Make sure you check out my other videos. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget. And yeah, get you a bottle of pink Moscato and have fun. Peace, love, bye-bye.